Since 2007, Sicilian artist Nino Quartana has been calling the Philippines his home. And to celebrate his fifth anniversary here, he recently showcased artworks very close to the Filipino heart, entitled Phases of Pinoy Rock. Faces of Pinoy Rock celebrated the varied beats and rhythms that make up the Pinoy Rock scene. This all started with a chance encounter between Quartana and Sandwich's Raymond Marasigan, whose quirky face inspired the collection. He met Raymond Marasigan at that party, and uh, while they were talking, he just popped this line, I like your face, it's very distinct, I'd like to paint you. And being there, right there, right there and then, I was thinking like, why only one Pinoy rock star? So, so I said, yes, yes, uh, Mr. Mercy, can you join? Please, please say yes, because we're doing Faces of Pinoy Rock Stars exhibit. And that's how the idea came about. The inspiration really also comes from the music of the bands we've, we've chosen. And the very first painting is Baroque and Edgar. Baroque music, it's fun, it's very colorful, and it's so alive. And you'd see it in the painting. It's like music and the, and, and the painting in one. The colors and themes of each artwork is inspired by the type of music each artist or group puts out. Whether it be bubbly and fun like Baroque and Edgar and Sandwich, or dark with a sense of humor like Kamikaze. Quartana also paid tribute to the beauty of Philippine nature as he incorporated volcanic ash from Mount Mayon into his pieces. Also sprinkled liberally throughout his artworks are Little Lizards, his personal tribute to Jim Morrison of the Doors, who was, of course, known as the Lizard King. There was also an extra treat for the art and music lover, where many music players were mounted for everyone's delight. Faces of Pinoy Rock, you know, it's, it's a trend-setting visual arts marketing promotions project and we would like to capture or bring art to a wider audience. It's to, to give a wider appreciation for art and, and our Pinoy music. And it's, it's good because when you say rock music, it, appeal, it appeals to the young, the youth, and that's that's what we're trying to, to capture, the attention of the youth through, vi through this visual arts exhibit. These rocking artworks will travel across the country, so you still have a chance to catch a glimpse before they ultimately go to the participating bands and artists.